Hi, we're going to have a quick chat about cholesterol. The first thing that people think about, well, most people, when they hear about carnivore diet is, what about the fat and the cholesterol? Like, it's really bad for you. You're going to have a heart attack or have a stroke. And that's not true. Um, cholesterol is essential for our health. It's um, a lot of it. I think about 50% of the myelin sheet in your brain is made up from cholesterol. So it's pretty important. Your body makes cholesterol. So we make about 70% of the cholesterol that our body needs, but the remaining 30% you actually have to get through food. So if cholesterol was that bad, we wouldn't be making it, making it and we also wouldn't rely on it. Uh, cholesterol can actually act as an anti-inflammatory property in the body. Pretty important. Um, it's basically the base for all hormones. So for your, for your testosterone and your estrogen. So if you don't have enough cholesterol, you're going to be struggling making hormones. So if you don't have enough cholesterol, you're not making enough testosterone, and then essentially you cannot make enough uh, estrogen in the ovaries later on because estrogen comes from testosterone. Um, then you can end up with PCOS, um, which is pretty common for a lot of women. Um, and so something to think about if you've been avoiding fat, it's probably a good idea to up your fats. Uh, cholesterol is also used in every single cell. So in the cell membrane, uh, your body's using cholesterol to build that. So it's not bad. You're not going to overeat um, fat or cholesterol. You can have blood work done. I would allow a couple of months at least between blood works um, to see the difference. And if you have any questions, send me a message. But again, I'm not a doctor. I'm a nutritionist. I don't give medical advice. But I am presenting you with information about cholesterol and why we need cholesterol and where you can find cholesterol. So mainly eggs, but also in fatty meats, a little bit in basically all, all animal foods. Thanks.